I think there's really one piece of information that most of you need to know about. Unimportant that the domestic violence organizations are not supportive. It's unimportant that the facts are that the majority of accidents that take place with handguns in the home when there's untrained individuals handling them occur against family members and friends. It's unimportant that most of the people who will be harmed by this are children and un un unarmed family members. The only thing that most of you are concerned about this bill is that there's a certain national organization that supports it. That's the only thing that you should be concerned about. And when you vote, I hope that satisfies your mind that you're doing the best thing, the right thing for the people intended to be, to be uh, protected by this bill. The only thing that's important is that there's a certain national organization that supports it. So despite the fact that children and family members are most likely to be harmed by the untrained handling of handguns in the home, despite that, despite the fact that the organizations that are officially um, supportive of and professionals in the domestic violence community are not supporting this bill, don't worry about that. Just know that you're doing the right thing by some organization that it, by a very important national organization. An, an organization, by the way, Mr. Speaker, that touts the training aspect of the work that they do. They do excellent work in high schools all across the country. They do excellent work to educate the public. They do excellent work in a number of very important areas. But when it comes to this bill, don't worry about that. Don't look at that. That's not important to you. Just look at the fact that this organization supports the bill and be happy in your vote.